Hello guys, how you all doing? Hi it's everyone, friends, investors, lover of this channel. So today I'm going to a monumental building. You know, today is not about sales, just to appreciate man's engineering creativities and of course God's um, gift to nature, real estate land. Yes, yeah, so I'm going to the Alias Francais building today. Yes, Mike Adenuga Center, where you have the Alias Francais study building. Yes, it's a cultural phenomenon, you know. Like I always do sometimes, I go to monumental places just to show you around, to show you the building, to appreciate um, the architecture, the engineering, real estate, the luxury, and everything that has to do with the designing and all. So so me and Ruth on the way, on our way to Mike Adinuga Center. Yeah, we promised to have fun today. You know, we're gonna talk about um, everything, alias Francel. Well, not necessarily everything, but we're gonna talk as much as we can, and um, it's gonna be an exciting time. You get Ruth is actually a student of alias Francel so um she's gonna give me some of the info that i will be sharing on the video so be patient relax just sit back have a lovely time enjoy this video and subscribe to the channel yeah see you soon So we are on Lake Ebers Pressway on our way from Aja down to Ikoi. So Why we're on the way? Let me just run you through um, about the Alias Francel. You know, it's a local non-profit organization led by an elected committee of members and an executive director with the support of the Embassy of France in Nigeria. You know, so um, French studies are taught in this center to adults and as well even to children you know um it's like the official license center for to carry out french studies and french exam in nigeria it is independent of the french embassy busty i mean kind of affiliated to it you know but it's um located in of course in my kadenuga buildings and it's just it's a brand new infrastructure because it was opened in um, 2019 you know so it's um a very nice architectural building and there's lots more to it it's not just a, a french center there's cinema on it um there are theater there's art gallery media library um you know french library french bakery and there's a restaurant in it as well so it's like a will i say a cultural artifact a cultural tourist um, attraction you get so it's much more than just going there to study french you know so it's a cultural phenomenon to to lagos state and then um, to nigeria as a whole so i'll be going to the building today just to show you around the the buildings and everything you need to know about the um center there's also um like an art exhibition all on it you know like a, a, an art gallery you get yet so it promises to be fun so just follow me along the way i'm just gonna like skip through the whole video and take you down to the center the project was born from a partnering franco nigerian collaboration entirely financed by the patron himself um, Mr. Mike Adenuga, you know, who is I think African second richest man and um, a lover of France, you know, it was inaugurated by the president of you know, France, Mr. President Emmanuel Macron himself, and the building was completed in less than a year under the direction of the Nigeria architectural firm. The cultural center is now the most active in the country with programming influenced by nigerians french and french speakers you know it also offers um, translational services as well on languages 
then um, you can hold your event there too. You can hold your concerts, you can hold your entertainment um, performances, theater performances, you know. So it's a lovely, cozy place you get. So, um, and as well, you can even hold um, festivals, um, theme festivals, book festivals, photo festivals, food festivals, just name it. It's a whole lot you can do in the center, you know. For more, you can get in touch with the center um, through their um, Instagram pages. And um, you get all the necessary info you need. Yes, so um, we have arrived now. This is the Alias Francais Center. This is just um, the surrounding and this is the road to the restaurant you get so ideally when you come in as a stranger you are supposed to actually go to the you know um front desk the receptionist desk but we we went through the restaurant because of course my friend she's a student there and me i'm like i'm a member to the center you know so we already had like that access instead of going through the front desk we just went straight to the um restaurant we pass through the restaurant street to upstairs so these are like the classes um there's a library just by the glass wall you've seen on the video i don't want to go um, there so that's what i'm filming from if i don't really want because there are people having classes so i don't want to like interrupt and i mean disturb anything you get ideally i'm never supposed to um be disturbing why classes are holding but because I want to bring you um, food, man, this video, so I had to do that, yes. So we are climbing off the staircase to the study centers as well, you know. Um, the other part of it are located in different aspects of it. Um, the art gallery, the halls, you know, the, they are all in different um, aspect of the building. So this study center is usually very, very quiet, you know, even as we climb, you can't even hear a noise. It's very quiet. This year, like we have the classes located and um, students come in to learn. So it's quiet. I, ju I just want to show you um, an overview of it. It's very neat, you know, a lot of stuff are written in, in, in French. Yeah. So um, you see the nice scenery. These are um, all classroom staff rooms. You get you can see that's from a video view. There's the restroom, you know, female restroom. Mm, lovely. Lovely. Um, then we are coming down back to the restaurant. We came in through the restaurant and we are coming down back to the restaurant. This is the restaurant food yes, is quite expensive. So if you are going to eat here, be prepared to, you know load your pockets <laughs> yes yeah, so um it's a really lovely place um the rest restaurant is called erikesa erikesa yes so as a lover of art i'm going to see the um artistic paintings in the art gallery this is actually the road from the restaurant this to like the receptionist the ideally if you are a visitor you won't pass through here you pass from the outside to the receptionist straight but because we came in through erikesa so that's why we are having this access you know yes so um this just leads you to the receptionist desk and the um at center where you have um, a lot of um, painting exhibitions you know from different artists oh god i love art so much i was a science no, student so but my love for art is something else <laughs> know me you know 
I'm someone that appreciates the uniqueness and creativity of the human capacity. You know, um, it treats me a lot because me myself, I'm a very creative thinker. I have always um, lots of ideas inside my mind. My mind is so powerful. Yes, so um, I just appreciate um, out of the box things when I see them, whether it's art, whether it's science, whether it's um, marketing, whether it's socials, any aspect of life. I just appreciate people really putting in their creativity and artistry into something, you know, and um, art as a whole, all aspect of art is one of my um, favorite aspects in life you know i love um, arts i love real estate i love tourism i love um, travels i love places i love um, um buildings i love nature vegetation you know so it, it was just a very nice experience um, going through this building there's the outside view from the outside view so there's a little um, outside or something like um, a little coliseum built outside and you can even use to hold your mini event you know it's i think it's it actually huge it may even have up to 500 sitting capacity because it's just in the open space and it's built in like a, a coliseum like the way the italian coliseum was built just a, a, a mini a mini form of it yes yeah. so this is the gate i'm gonna leave you now with some lovely pictures um, i took with my friend this is the outside i want to snap yeah some pictures yeah. thank you and, um, all, as well as all the pictures i took at the art gallery so i'm coming um, enjoy enjoy the view and I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to get in touch for all your real estate lands and houses in Lagos State, Nigeria, and other places in Nigeria. Please subscribe to the channel, share with your colleagues, your friends, your family. Subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching. See you soon. Bye.